Hey everybody on YouTube, it's Rude Boy, and today I'm going to give you guys a quick tutorial on how I edit my gameplay videos for my Elgato HD60 capture card. Now as you guys can see from the screen recording, I am on a Mac using OS X L Captain. And three programs you're going to need for this is, of course, your Elgato Game Capture HD capture card, Final Cut Pro X10, and Compressor, which is a Final Cut Pro program. First, we're going to go into Final Cut Pro X10, import your media. I'm going to go to my desktop, and I already have a clip recorded, so I'm going to import that. Once that's imported, you're going to go to New Project. You can either add an existing project or use your current projects. So I'm going to use my current project right now and hit OK. We're going to select the clip right here and drop it to our timeline. Now we're going to do some color correction for the video. So now we're going to go into select the clip, hit correction, and go to saturation. And we're going to move this slide up a little bit right here. Okay, so the saturation is going to be up. Look at the, the difference from that put it up right there you don't need to go above that I think that's just perfect for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 in my opinion and what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to modify you're gonna select the clip first sorry and go to modify and hit balance color now once you're done with that we're gonna go into the video effects right here in the bottom and you're gonna search for sharpen now once you find sharpen you're gonna drop it right into the actual video now let me just give you guys a quick view on how that looks. Alright, now what we're going to do is we're going to actually encode and compress the video for YouTube. So now we're going to go into File, select the clip one more time, hit File and select Send to Compressor. Now it's already sent to the compressor as you can see right here. Now I'm going to use one of the presets already made in compressor but I'm actually going to just edit some of the options in there. So we're going to hit add outputs and we're going to go to video sharing services and we're going to hit 1080p HD. Now what you're going to do is go to video right here. H.26 profile, you're going to want to change that to high. And as you can see right here, it says quick time setting, H.26 multipass. You want to change that to fast encode single pass. Now the bit rate, I usually keep it around 15 megabytes to 25 megabytes. As you guys know, YouTube is going to encode that again for you, so it's probably going to only be like 8 megabytes. So it's definitely up to you what you want to use but personally I think 20 megabytes is perfect and it looks great once you're done with that you're gonna hit OK and you're gonna hit start batch and it's gonna start encoding that video for you once it's done you just upload it to YouTube guys if you have any other suggestions on how you guys make your videos look even better leave a comment below rate subscribe and comment and any questions I will definitely respond to everybody